सो हेलो गाइज वेलकम टू द स्किल्स फ्यूजन और आज हम लोग खेलने जा रहे हैं हॉगोट्स लगे से फिर क्योंकि और कोई गेम खेलने में मजा ही नहीं आ रहा है Off on another adventure, are we? Love to have a house in one of the nearby hamlets. Revelio. Last time, we did a lot of things. A lot of things. Hello, Hamora. We went to the cave. We went to the cave. We went to the cave. अब हम लोगों ने स्केल्टन से फाइट की। और एक जगह तो बहुत बुरा फंसा भी था मैं। But somehow we managed. Hello, Hamora. It's maybe Jadua. Right. Revelio. The class is here. There, here, there. My aunt says I should get to Hogsmeade as often as I can. Says it's good to go. Let's take our permission now. कोड़ा है कितना दूर चलो स्पोर करते हैं आई थिंक उसकी सिस्टर से मिलने जाना ये राइट 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 उसने बुलाया ने बोला था अब ना तो जा सकता हूँ उसने बोला कि हाँ हम जा सकते हैं उसके बहन को अच्छा लगे हो गुड्स का कोई स्टूडेंट उससे मिलना है सो लेट्स डू दिस Hmm. Seems a pleasant enough little place. Revelio. Not enough reflection on the path. Nice to see you again. Likewise. What can I help <coughs> you with today? 
I'd like to ask you a few things, if you don't mind. What would you like to know? Would you mind telling me a little about Kingbridge? You've likely heard talk of the thieving troll that unfortunately settled in the area. Been terrorizing people. Robs all who pass by. So you'd be wise to remain vigilant whilst traveling near Kingbridge. You would not want to come face to horrid face with that monstrous thing. How did you come to live here in Kingbridge? I've only been here a few years. Used to sell my wares as I traveled. It was an exhausting life, but I never minded it. One day, my travels brought me through Cambridge. I fell in love. Though my travels continued, my heart remained here. So I eventually returned and opened this shop. Been here ever since. I shall live out my days here in Cambridge if I have any say in it. Which I suppose I do. What sorts of things do you sell? Potions. <coughs> I brew each one myself, using only the finest ingredients. I assure you, you won't find their equal anywhere, even in Hogsmeade. What do you have for sale? What are we looking for today? She don't have potions. Thank you for stopping in. I appreciate it. हेल्थ पोर्शंस नहीं है, बट हम लोग हेल्थ पोर्शंस के बिना भी कई बार लड़ चुके हैं। रेवेलियो Rebellion. You'll regret crossing my path. Perhaps I shall scout around Hellcroft for something to poach. I never met a beast. I... <laughs> ah, but you trusted the wrong kind. And we see you about to echo your folly. Revelio.
Revelio. Revelio. I know I heard something that time. Revelio. I wonder who lives here. I should dismount here. Revelio. You made it. Yeah, it was a long trip. Enjoying the view? Keeping an eye on things. Feldcroft isn't what it used to be. No one has felt safe here since Ranrock's loyalists took a peculiar interest in that castle over there. Rookwood Castle. My uncle Solomon is a former Aura and refuses to look into it, even after Anne was cursed by one of them. Possibly with a wand, no less. I heard a goblin refer to wizard kind as wand carriers. A goblin's forbidden from carrying ones. Precisely. That's why I'm on the hunt for answers. If I'm to cure her, I need to understand what happened to her. Anne was always the most mischievous of the three of us. Which is saying something, knowing me and Ominous. I'm hoping a surprise visit from me and a new friend from Hogwarts will help lift her spirits. Bring back the Anne I used to know. Come on, I'll take you to my uncle's. This way. Feldcroft used to be a lot livelier. With Ranrock's lot wandering about all the time, everyone stays out of sight. Revelio. Here we are. My sister should be just inside. Aha! Sebastian, where did you... Is that what I think it is? We've been over this, boy. Hey. Shrivel figs cannot reverse a curse. <coughs> Nothing can. The sooner you accept that reality, the better. But we haven't tried everything. There is no cure! When will you accept that? Never! I can never accept it. <laughs> Now look what you've done. I'm sorry. I'm sorry you had to see that. If you don't mind, I just need a moment alone. Poor Sebastian. Not the visit he'd hoped for. 
Revelio. I'm uh, sorry about earlier. Those bouts of pain are difficult to bear. Can I take it on? I am very hungry. Sorry. Are you all right, Anne? I, I didn't mean to intrude. You didn't, <coughs> truly. <sighs> and I'm all right. The pain from this curse comes in bouts, and often suddenly. It's not anyone's fault. It's nice to meet you, by the way. You must be the new fifth year Sebastian told me about. I am. Sebastian and I met during a rather lively duel in defense against the dark arts. Oh, dear Professor Hecate. She's a powerful witch. And she knows how to keep students like my brother, and me, in line. I do miss Hogwarts, but I wouldn't mind being at Feldcroft, really, if it wasn't so dreary now. Between the goblins at the castle and my uncle fighting with Sebastian whenever he's home, it's not the cosy retreat it once was. Sebastian mentioned something about your uncle being an ex-Aura, but refusing to go after Ranrock's loyalists. I must say, I wasn't prepared for him to be as angry as he was. Uncle Solomon is frustrated by what happened to me and by Sebastian for thinking he can fix it. They both mean well, I know they do, but my uncle is right. This curse cannot be undone. I can feel it. Sebastian cannot take away my pain. Perhaps you can help him to understand that. I'll do my best. I can promise to speak with him about it. Thank you. His search for a cure is futile, I'm afraid. I'm getting tired. I should probably rest. Thank you for stopping by. I wish you well. Don't worry about me. Take care. Revelio. Oh, yes. Incendio. How is it? Expelliarmus. Confringo. Revelio. <laughs> Hello, nice to meet you. Welcome. I'm Bernard <coughs> Indiaye, and this is my shop. Is there anything I can help you with? I'm curious to know what's happening in Feldcroft. Might you have any insight? An incredibly unpleasant goblin called Belgroft the Bludgeoner has been tormenting everyone he encounters. Feldcroft borders goblin country, but we've always lived in peace with their kind. Until recently, that is. Some claim that Belgroth and his associates are in league with Ranrock. I don't know if there's truth to it. Whatever the case, their constant meddling is devastating business. Everyone feels unsafe. It's quite serious. What do you have for sale? What are we in the market for today?
Revelio. Revelio. Rebellion. Revelio. Revelio. That boy will fray my last nerve. Excuse me, Mr. Sallow. Oh, yes, Sebastian's friend. I apologize on behalf of my nephew. He <coughs> doesn't know when to stop. I was about to check on Anne. Did I see you come from the house? How is she? She's all right. She said she was going to rest. Nothing can be done for her. I understand you've tried everyone from Nurse Blaney to St. Mungo's to no avail. We have. My nephew thinks he knows better than the healers. Perhaps the healers don't know everything, sir. Sebastian is single-mindedly focused on finding a way to help his sister. If there is a cure, he will find it. Your faith in Sebastian is misplaced. Some sort of dark magic cursed Anne, and the goblins aren't likely to explain themselves any time soon. Giving her hope is cruel. The only thing to do now is keep Anne comfortable and stay out of the Loyalists' way. I understand what you're saying, sir. Good. I know what's best for Anne and Sebastian. They are my stubborn brother's children. Especially Sebastian. If you really want to be of help, you'll make sure Sebastian does what he should do, not what he wants to do. He's no idea the harm he could do if he doesn't stop. <coughs> I hope you'll remember what I've said. Good Rebellion. day. Rebellion. 
I ought to see how Sebastian's faring. Why will he not listen to me? She's my sister. How are you doing, Sebastian? You got a first-hand glance at what I'm dealing with. I apologize for my uncle. I know he's angry, but he's only trying to do what he thinks is best for Anne. He's always angry. He's been angry since my parents died. After Anne was hurt, he only grew worse. It's as though he blames me somehow, always calling me my father's son, as if that's an insult. I'm the one trying to help her. He's simply given up. Both Anne and your uncle seem genuinely convinced that nothing more can be done for her. I refuse to believe that. Anne's pain is more than physical. It has changed her entirely. I miss my sister. And I'm going to get her back. Come with me. I need to show you where it happened. Ranrock's loyalists are capable of so much more than people realize. They should not be underestimated. All the debris you'll see is from whatever's going on at that abandoned estate. They've been digging for something. Up there, on that plateau, is where they cursed Anne. This way. Revelio! How much longer are we expected to dig through this rubble? Ramrock knows what he's doing. It's an honor to be a part of it. Only good wizard is a dead wizard in my book. Okay. Well, this might be the best meal I've had in years. No, I mean it. I don't think I shall need to eat again till next week. Accio, Descendo, Fringo, Tulsa. No! Levioso. I will. Confringo, Incendio. I won't rest. Incendio. Oh, you don't believe you can defend the Potato. You don't know who you're playing with. Incendio. I don't have health. You're like a clump. Bumble Bunny, my fate. This will be Where is he? Revelio. Confringo. Confringo. Come at me, bro. Come at me. You will hit it. This is almost too easy. Confringo. Incendio. Expelliarmus. Confringo. Accio. Incendio. Accio. 
back here. I won't rest until you're dead. Almost. Nice try. Back here. Ah! आपके हेल्थ थोड़ी बढ़ जाने दो आगे भी है सेवेस्टर क्या कर रहा है भाई कहा ले आया भाई मैं तो बिल्ली के इरादे से आया था रिवेलियो वन लेस शिवन टू वरी अबाउट आकियो प्रोटेगो confess that was a bit small than i'd bargained for i tried to warn you ha huh. bula ke war kar rahe chal raha hai besarab sarab bhi dari bolte hue repair her Those loyalists deserved what they got. Couldn't agree more. This is where it happened. We smelt smoke <coughs> in the middle of the night. When we looked outside, flames were shooting from the estate. Before my uncle and I could stop her, Anne rushed out, racing towards the fire, worried someone would be hurt. She came face to face with a horde of goblins, frantically trying to stamp out the flames. Suddenly, an icy voice drifted out from somewhere in the smoke. children should be seen and not heard a blinding blast followed they didn't even give her a chance to run it sounds as if the loyalists attacked them without cause i wouldn't put it past them but i'm convinced that they were trying to hide something it may be grasping at billywigs But I keep thinking that there might be something here that could lead me to whoever cursed Anne. Might be the only way to learn what type of magic harmed her, which could help me find a cure. Perhaps you're right. The loyalists are everywhere, but they do seem to be spending a lot of time here, and it's likely they're hiding something. And at Rookwood Castle. Shall we have a look around? They seem to have set up camp here for a specific reason. They have stations for everything. Whose home was this? It's been abandoned long since I've lived here. Rumor was incendiary. Centuries ago. But that's all I ever heard. Revelio. Oh. 
Always armed and ready for a fight, Ranrock's loyalists. Revelio! I've heard that goblin dig sites like these are popping up everywhere. Hmm. It's a wonder the Ministry isn't doing more. It might be worth taking a closer look at the house itself. Revelio. Confringo. This well looks familiar. Revelio. Sebastian, I've seen this before. This house, the well, the view. What do you mean? When? Give me a moment. I'll explain in a second. Sebastian, over here. Do you think that this was damaged by the fire the night that Anne was cursed? Revelio could be but it looks to me as though this was intentional. Sebastian, this house did belong to a Hogwarts professor hundreds of years ago. Who? <coughs> what do you <coughs> found a pensive that day in the restricted section with a memory that showed this house? There was a little girl and a drought. The keepers have shown me other memories as well. The girl became a Hogwarts professor. Her name was Isadora Morganark. She was one of the Keepers. The Keepers? Like in Quidditch? And you found a pensive in the library? I'm not following you. I realize it's a lot to take in. I'm not even sure I understand it all yet. And no, not like Quidditch. They call themselves Keepers because they're protecting some type of knowledge. It has to do with the vault at Gringotts. Let me see if I've got this straight. You have Ranrock and Rookwood after you because of something you found at Gringotts where you ended up via a port key. You can see traces of an ancient magic that you think Ranrock is trying to harness. And now you've been witnessing memories left by keepers. Oh, and this house belonged to a Hogwarts professor who was one of these non-Quidditch keepers hundreds of years ago. If I didn't know you, I'd think you were pulling my leg. It is all a bit much, isn't it, when you put it like that? The point is, we both have good reason to search this house. You for answers about what happened to Anne, and me for answers about the Keepers. <coughs> Revelio, look at this. Someone piled this here for a reason. Is it blocking something? Accio. Only one way to find out. Devolta. Huh, a stairwell. Revelio. Why bother blocking a stairwell? There might be something here worth a closer look. They've left all of this simply strewn about. It tells me they're after something bigger. Yes, they can look off camp more. He's a little doctor. A journal entry of his adorers. I should hold on to this. Seems these journal entries are from Isadora's travels. Revelio! Deposit! Revelio! You're not going to believe this. I can see the Undercroft. What? A daydream? 
because that happens to me too. I know it sounds strange, Honestly, but, uh... nothing you say sounds strange to me anymore. Fair enough. <laughs> oh, yeah. Point. I can see the Undercroft through this stone wall as though it's a window. This has happened before. I'm listening. I think it's to do with my ability to see traces of ancient magic. But you said you didn't really understand it and that you couldn't wield it. That's true. And I'm still not sure what it all means. What I do know is that my ability allows me to travel through these windows, I see. Wait. We can get straight to the Undercroft from here. <laughs> Ominous will be flawed. We can. But perhaps best not to tell anyone else about this for now. Even Ominous. Understood. Well then, invisible secret ancient magic passageway, here we come. Here we come. Revelio. I'm tempted to hold my breath. Let's go guys, you'll be there. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I'll be there. एक मिरर की मदद से होगोट्स आ रहे Why would the door lead us here? Sebastian, look. <coughs> Something is missing. Why hide a triptych here? Seems as if something's missing. A note. Let's have a look. Instant magic well, yes, in well, yes, Anything helpful in the note? Revelio. A rune symbol. I've seen similar symbols used by the keepers. I've been thinking. A keeper lived in that house centuries ago. And Ranrock and his lot have been searching there. You said that goblins may be wielding some form of this ancient magic. Do you think Anne was cursed by ancient magic? I can't be sure, of course, but I don't think so. I didn't see any traces of it around your sister. Hmm. Very well. But that doesn't mean it's not ancient magic. There's still so much we don't know about it. True. Perhaps this triptych will lead us to answers. Then we'll have to unravel what this all means. But now I need to see Ominous. Don't worry, I won't tell him anything. Did I mention that, apparently, Salazar Slytherin had a secret scriptorium here, in Hogwarts? You did not. Sounds worth looking into. Any idea where in the castle? No idea. Ominous just learned of it. I'll let you know what I find out. I had no idea our visit to Sian would unfold into all of this. My head's an utter mess. But I'm glad you told me everything you did. I'll be in touch. Revelio. Yes. Spell class start okay. Let's go.
ये जो भी देख रहे हो डोंट फॉरगेट टू लाइक एंड सब्सक्राइब बहुत मेहनत लग रही है Have you finished your assignments? Yes, sir. I have. Done. I finished the tasks, Professor. Well, well. I trust you are meticulous in your efforts. After all, shortcuts only ever lead to shortcomings. Yes, sir. Of course. Good. Ordinarily, I'd say it's not my concern either way, but you. I want to make sure you're well prepared. Talent and resolve are a potent combination. It would be a shame to let that go to waste. Thank you, Professor. Don't let it go to your head. Now, let's see how you fare with Defindo. Wand at the ready. Focus. Defindo can be dangerous if you're not paying attention. Hmm. Very good. It seems you have a grasp on Defindo. Defindo. It's a pleasure to have a student who actually heeds instruction. earlier, Defindo can be versatile but dangerous. Good to see you continuing to practice. Okay, so I don't have talent point, I guess. So spells my Defindo ka bhi aa jayega ab. Check with the check in the dick check in with dick. Okay, so secrets may have an affair.
Deke. Ah, Deke is so happy to see you. Deke noticed this bag in the room the other day. You must need it to help with your schoolwork. Deke has seen one of these before. Deke calls it a knapsack. What are you trying to do, Dick? Perfect for gathering and transporting beasts. <laughs> Pleasant little breeze. I have been thinking about something Professor Howen said in Beasts class, that I should study as many beasts as I can on my own time. She also mentioned that poachers have been active in the area. So, perhaps the beasts will be safer with us than out on their own. Precisely what Deke was thinking. You see, the room knew exactly what you needed. And luckily, Deke can show you how to best use the knapsack and where. Come along then. Our first stop will be beyond the castle grounds. We can leave now, or you can come and find Deke when you're ready to go. आ रहा हूँ। अच्छा। I'm ready to learn how to use the knapsack. Perfect! Deke loves an outing. A nasty poacher. Deke hated working for him. He did horrible things to beautiful beasts. Oh. It was during those days that Deke first saw a knapsack. Uh, it'll be nice to see one used for good. We have arrived. Deke enjoys coming here to watch the beasts, especially the puffle of puff skeins nearby. It will be nice to keep them safe. All you will need to do is get close, direct the open knapsack toward the puff skein, and in it'll go. All right. Okay. So what I need to do? Okay, spell me set karna hai. You got one! 
Revelio. I want to run more. <laughs> Believe this, Revelio. Oh, no, you don't. Revelio. That's it. I managed to rescue a puffskin. You can rescue as many as the knapsack will hold. Poachers capture puffskins and, well, Deke isn't sure what they do with them. Deke is certain they will be safer with you. Now, not all beasts will be as simple to rescue as a puffskin. Deke suggests you next find a beast that can fly. A jobbernol, perhaps. All right. Where would I find one? Deke knows of some to the west, nesting in a large tree overlooking Hogwarts. But we must be careful. Deke has seen poachers in the area recently. Deke will meet you there whenever you're ready. Everything's all right now. Hello, Deke. Shall we continue? Oh, good. Deke was worried about you, what with all the poachers in the area. Perhaps we should work quickly. The jobbernals are just here, in this large tree. If it's helpful, Deke has seen Levioso used to slow flying beasts. Easier to get in close and use the knapsack. What if I can't find any beasts in their usual habitat? Beasts won't stray too far from their homes. Look nearby or simply wait a moment and they should return. Do you have any advice on how I can rescue more elusive beasts? Levioso is not only helpful when rescuing flying beasts, it, it can also help rescue beasts that are generally hard to catch. Try using that spell the next time you encounter a small or otherwise elusive beast. Would you mind talking a bit more about what it was like working for your former master? Deke's master was not kind to beasts, or to Deke. He saw beasts only as a source of income, to be used for potion ingredients and labor, and... Deke will not say more. But Deke is grateful to be at Hogwarts, where he can help care for beasts and make amends for the things his master made him do. Then I shall go and rescue a jobbernal. Good luck. Deke will be waiting. Yani Levioso bhi isme rakhna padega. Levioso. <laughs> After you. 
Revelio. Levioso. Now, now, I'm only trying to help. Professor Howen will never believe this. Revelio. Levioso. Revelio. Levioso. Revelio. Levioso. Duke. Accio. Levioso. yourself. I mean you no harm. Akio. Levioso. Revelio. Levioso. Going to hurt you. I rescued a jobinol. Deke hopes your jobinol finds the knapsack nice and cozy. Poachers want them for their feathers and are not kind when they gather them. Are there any other beasts nearby? Just one that Deke knows of, a herd of moon calves. They live in a clearing of trees up this footpath. Deke will see you there. Bro, I can fly also. up to now nothing hello deke is this the clearing you mentioned it is moon calves gather near the large tree with the spiral pattern in front but only under the light of the moon so unfortunately unless you have a way to hasten time you might sometimes have to wait until nightfall to see them how did you end up at hogwarts after working for your former master Deke's prior master had no family, so when he died, all of his house elves were relocated by the Ministry. Deke was the most fortunate one as Deke was sent to Hogwarts. <laughs> Deke's friends were not as fortunate. I shall go and find a moon calf then. Deke will be waiting for your return. Revelio. I told on a wait card. Akia. 
kill. Revelio. Revelio. Let's see. Okay, talent, uh, talent, look at it. के उसमें दबाने का तो कुछ लिखा नहीं है कि यार के दबाने से टाइम चेंज होता है Revelio.
Revelio. Revelio. Hogs mid chal rahe the jab tak to main spell bechne jab tak Moon Cleft Den yahan aana hai mujhe wapas. Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? We have everything a young student might need when it comes to potions. Have a good look around. to see you again. Farewell for now. A wise decision. Thank you. I hope to see you again. Farewell for now. Go broom wale ke paas bhi chalte hain. Historically speaking, there's never been a team like this year's cannons. You're back! Nice to see you again. What are we looking for today? You'll be thrilled with that broom, I promise you. Nice doing business with you. Thanks for stopping by. Hope to see... I must tell you, half of Ogsmead's been by the shop asking about rumours of a broom upgrade. 
Without the information you provided, my work would have taken twice as long. Thank you again. It may sound ambitious, but I've already begun work on another upgrade, more difficult to perfect than the last. I wondered, would you be interested in joining forces again? There's another course near Irondale that Miss Reyes has mastered. If you were to test this first upgrade there, it may help me as I develop the next. Oh, you'll consider it, won't you? What more can you tell me about the next course? It's just a jaunt from here, south of Oxmead. Beautiful mountain views. The course was designed to test flyer stamina. Some of your classmates mentioned they were headed there, eager to see what Imelda has in store. A bit surprising, considering many of them express reticence at the idea of racing against her at all. I hope that won't deter you, and you'll give the course a go. At least think on it. Sounds as if you're really outdoing yourself. If I'm able to help, I will. Thank you. I know this recent success was only the beginning of what I can do for Broom Flight. Report back as soon as you can, and we'll be off to the races. Off to the races, then. Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Welcome. Do you let me know if I can be of any assistance at all. I need help potions. A wise decision. Thank you. I hope to see you again. Farewell for now. Revelio. Hello, Hamora. Revelio. Revelio. Rebellion.
Revelio. What are you up to now? Depulsa. Descendo. Akio. Levioso. Revelio. Lumos. Hogsmeade, here I come. Almost night over here. Revelio. Oh, here's a pleasant surprise. Revelio. Confringo. Protego. Confringo. Revelio. Merlin trials won't get the best of me. Hmm. Is it night or chucky here?
you can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented flu powder. Revelio. Deke, what am I meant to be doing again? You should try to find a moon calf. Since they only come out at night, you may have to wait a little while, depending on what time it is. Revelio. Levioso. Revelio. Primero que es lustre la cabeza de ese. Revelio. Levioso. I'll look after you. Revelio. Revelio. Levioso. But everything's all right now. Revelio. Levioso. Professor Howen will never 
believe this. Accio! Levioso! Done. Nick, it's done. It was a bit trickier than the others, but I have a moon <coughs> calf now. Another beast, safe and sound. Shame we didn't see the moon calves dancing. It's a marvelous sight. Deke supposes you're finished here. He'll be able to rescue many more beasts, but for now, let's bring the ones you've gathered back to the room. All right. Deke will meet you back in the room whenever you're ready. I'm coming right now because I wanted to see. Dick thinks you should be proud of... There you are. Now, we need to show the beast you rescued their new home. But, um, not enough room to let them out here. Imagine all those beasts running amok. That wouldn't do at all. Perhaps if you focus on what your beasts need, the room will provide. Hmm, what exactly did you think of? What is this? Oh, no. He's growing. He's growing. He's growing. He's growing. He's growing. He's growing. You've done it! But what is it? Deke isn't sure. Only one way to find out. Meet you inside when you're ready. I'd like to ask you about changing the room's ambience. Of course. Uh, what sort of overall look most appeals to you? Actually, perhaps another time. Look at this. It's amazing. Where are we, Deke? It seems to be a place for your beasts to live, a vivarium of some sort. Oh, your beasts will be quite comfortable here. They'll live healthy, safe lives. Perhaps you want to release them, let them see their new home. thinks the vivarium will be a fitting new home for your beasts. Indeed. I only hope we'll have enough space for all of them. Deke hopes so too. But if you do run out of room, Madam Peck at Brood and Peck in Hogsmeade will help to find safe homes for them. Any beasts that the room can't hold? Yes, she's well known for helping to care for beasts in need, and she'll give you a fair price for them. Speaking of care, beasts that are well-fed and groomed will provide you with valuable magical materials, such as puffskin hair, for example. If you gather some magical materials from your beasts, Dee can show you how to use them. Very well. I shall let you know when I have some.
ओ सबके लिए जगह ही नहीं है मैं जल्दी ही पकड़ ली ओ हो है 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 सबको बाहर निकाल देता हूँ फिर Settle yourself. I mean you no harm. <laughs> Wonderful. खिलाने को नहीं है आगे सब का हो गया
I guess it's time to go. I've collected some magical materials, Deke. Now Deke can show you how to use them. First, you'll need to use this spellcraft to conjure an enchanted loom. An enchanted loom? Exactly. It will allow you to use your magical materials to weave magic into the very threads of your clothing, making your clothing more useful in a variety of ways. Why don't you try it? Deke thinks you'll be impressed with what the loom can do. I'll go and experiment with the loom now. ठीक है गाइज बस आज के लिए इतना ही थैंक्स फॉर वॉचिंग स्किल फ्यूजन हम लोग ने आज बीस स्ट्रीम किया सेबेस्टन के बहन से मिले एंड यही सब चलाश <coughs> तो मिलते हैं नेक्स्ट वीडियो में तब तक के लिए थैंक्स फॉर वॉचिंग कीप वॉचिंग स्किल्स फ्यूजन मिलते हैं नेक्स्ट वीडियो में